What's up guys, where you are active blue gaming here, welcome back to some more Stormworks. Today we're gonna to be um checking out this spaceship. Yeah, and we've been, uh, been doing a lot of explosions lately on the channel, so I decided to we'll do spaceships. Well, I haven't done covered spaceships on my channel before. Yeah, it's a bit interesting but Yeah, spaceships are pretty cool. And the creator of this um amazing creation um updated it and so I saw it and updated it's like oh yeah I haven't done a video on this I think. But anyway, if you guys do enjoy this episode of Stormworx, make sure to drop a like and subscribe and let's take the elevator up and get ready for <coughs> lift off. It's got an, even got an amazing elevator. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's basically just one giant launch pad. Well, there is um no space in Stormworks, but I'm um, be going pretty high and wait a while. And now I've done it. Trying to travel to the Arctic. Hopefully we get to the Arctic and yeah. Okay. Let's uh get straight up here. Okay, the door's closed, that's the Touch the pilot seat. Okay, I'm going to be launching. Okay. We're going to space. We're lifting off. Come on, you can do it. Maximum affordable. Yeah. Whoa, yay. We were taking the entire barge with us just then. But we are going to accelerate pretty quickly. Really fast, actually. Man, we're going fast. We would, um, probably be, um... Okay, we're going around... 500 and... So not quite the speed of sound, but... Pretty fast. There's a lot of, um... rocket engines, but this fuel tank is pretty good. So we'll get up to an altitude of 10,000 and yeah, anyway I'm gonna take you a bit of a tour, hey it's even got a hold of torches, it's got oxygen masks, and then you're blowing oxygen. got welding torches. Yeah, it's got everything we could really need for it. Oh, it's getting colder and colder. Get up. Which is why the colder and colder it is. It means we're going into space. And man, we are pretty high. I think it starts to snow at this altitude. Oh yeah, it does snow. Which is having um, a pretty cool effect. I guess it's actually on the temperature now and... Well, has it always been like that? Cabin lights. Disconnect boosters. 
Oh, oh no. Yeah, I think we might need one. Disconnect it. It's not disconnecting. Okay. Okay, let's see if I can uh, set all of you on to the Arctic. Um, there we go, is there like an altitude moment or something? It even comes with a drag seat. Drag shoot, yeah there we go. They even got a, a lot of information about the, this space shuttle. I think it's called Space Shovel Discovery. Oh yeah, we also got the satellite to launch. And floating cameras. It is a really cool spaceship. The creator has updated it over the updates and has now added fire extinguishers. Okay, time to move the satellite into position. Okay, it'd be really cool if they did add space to Stormworks, but it doesn't really make that much sense, but I've added uh, explosions which some um, sort of makes sense. Set a light away. Hey, you can even see through the satellite feed, which is uh, pretty cool. Sooner you or later we're going to lose connection. Yeah, we gotta stop elevating. So you don't immediately crash. Hop on that fast. going fast now. I said it's auto pilot. It's like an altitude old. Every time I turn, more and more damage happens in the air. Is that like ats atmospheric drag or something? I think it's just the doors behaving strangely and it's gonna end up blowing up my entire goddamn space space shuttle. Yeah. Jeez. Probably not meant to be flying this mid. Oh, we're nowhere near. Gee, we're going slow. Man, a blackbird goes fast. Might as well just bring out the blackbird to go that far, because oh, we are not driving that far. Anyway, um, let's put it into a death spin and see what happens. And that's going to go well. Is that 10,000? We are now in a death spin, heading straight towards the ground. Hey, we look like a lover. Man, I actually look like we're in space. Uh, hey, well, guess what? The space the storm acts as if there's no stars under us. And I can see below us. From 10,000 flat feet. I don't know what that is. 
I'm just gonna say it's our meters. From 10,000 meters, you can see the mainland. Now, I guess the view distance is 20 kilometers, so. Yeah, it's 20 kilometers. I remember when it used to be a lot smaller before the mainland update. We are losing altitude pretty quickly. I have got an autopilot on. What am I clicking? Pointing the finger nose down is a pain. Okay, can we just go down over here? Thank you. You're going so slow, jeez, man. This is a slow space shuttle. This is a really slow space shuttle. It's literally slower than my grandma. So of my goddamn grandma. A space shuttle is slower than my grandma. Can't even move that fast. Jesus Christ, man! It's been so slow. I oh, am yeah. taking ten years. A blackbird goes fast. I saw seventy-one blackbird. Does it? And that isn't even designed to go to space. In space, you gotta go a lot faster. And you're still not going that fast. I don't understand why. Maybe it's fast, it's because I remember this thing used to go really fast. And now I think it's some um, engine that have been uh, turned down a little. But hey, we are finally... Ain't the slowest thing in the world, don't we, but... Still, I'm expecting something a lot faster from a jet-engined aircraft. It isn't an aircraft, it's a spacecraft. So... I was had to put down the landing key. Any lights? Some like good stuff. Oh, yeah, we crashed it. Get the drag chute. I said pull the drag chute. Get Dump the engines there. Jeez, it should not be this hard to land a plane. I mean a spacecraft. Jesus, I keep getting them mixed up. I'm so used to saying plane, but... Um, yeah, I think we're gonna... quickly leave... this um, area. Space shuttle, so I mean, we always break, and I guess that's one. So I'm like, damn wheel. The other wheels um, seem to be intact, so. Um, this one isn't just, just intact. Jeez, there's a lot of uh, damage on this car. Jesus, like a lot of damage. What about the engines? Are they fine? I think they're fine because they were probably the safest thing from the damage. Probably should not be standing behind um, some jet engines. Well, oh, these aren't rocket engines, so. Yeah. Even though they have added rockets to the game, I guess the person just didn't want to make rocket ones. So rocket fuel burns really fast, so... Maybe we get rid of uh, most of its uh, practicality. I think that's how you say it. 
I don't know, man. I don't know how to say things. Jesus Christ. I don't even like the way that I need a weird dictionary or something. Uh, if you need any sort of, um, oh no, put this, uh, the trip. Jesus. Okay. Any, um, um, word advice, um, literacy advice, don't, don't ask me, because I have no idea what I'm even doing. I can read pretty well, but, and I can't seem to pronounce R's for some reason. I can just say R, but, I can see that, but I can't say, you know, the other meaning, when you're doing words, which is super annoying. I think I can sort of say it. it's like, er, yeah, I can say it. it just sounds really forced and very off the map. Wait, sound like I said W then, I said word then, which uh, is a bit right? Yeah, anyway, enough rambling, um, jeez. Anyway, it's been a very interesting and crazy episode, but I think we're going to leave this episode of Stormworks here, and if you enjoyed it, make sure to drop a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later in the next video, maybe, unless I die.